Caldwell will have the call after the break. What does a say super dry taste like? Let me show you. And they have taken 10 points from five games in the league. And for the first time since joining Major League Soccer and into Miami, Lionel Messi faces Canadian opposition as we're under Kobe Franklin with a lovely ball forward down the right side into the path of Bernadeschi, but it's Kamal Miller to last Tuesday. Bernadeschi's ball whipped into the front post where it's headed away there by the Ukrainian defender Krivsov. And Insigne trying to win it back but unable to do so. And here's the 300 game mark. Uh, Victor Vasquez giving it away into the path of Joseph Martinez. Six goals this season for Joseph Martinez. Wasn't the easiest start to his Miami career. But a man who has scored. Petretta looks to get that ball back in towards Lorenzo Insigne. Wayward from Insigne, who has four goals and five assists this season. Now picked up by DeAndre Kerr, who's into the box. Callender makes the save, and Kerr can't score on the rebound. Two wonderful chances for Toronto. Philadelphia before the international break. Here's Joseph Martinez against Bradley. And what's a corner? Felt like there was a sixth appearance in the box as this one comes all the way back out to Farias, who plays that cross in and Thomas away by Bradley but picked up by Lionel Messi Croatia did really well there as Messi picks it up gets away from Croatia driving towards the edge of the box Lionel Messi straight at Romero first warning first little glimpse of the spaces that he likes to attack and how you have to be on your guard when the tackles come flying in and Messi actually got Someone to translate a message to Kamal Miller and said, I really appreciate what you do for me, how you're always the first one there, standing up for me. Busquets, out for Miller on the left. Coelho goes to close down. Miller's crosses straight towards Romero. Not a bad ball in a good area. Jordi Alba, through for Messi. Oh, lovely feet from Messi. Now there's space on the left as the cross is chipped into the middle. Little Messi! And gets this one wrong, he should header it. Maybe he can't quite get there with the head and he allows to let it come on to the boot, but I think he's got an opportunity to get his, his head on this one. Lovely flick. This is where TFC have broke down the last five minutes, giving the ball away in good area. Sylvania this time. Cut of last year when they won 2 0 at Charlotte. Free kick here, given by Drew Fisher. Messi standing over the free kick with the delivery, forcing Romero to punch. He got a good distance on that one. And offside, as Jordi Alba was looking to get things going again. Oejo with the ball through towards Cesorio, and Yedlin gets it back to Calendar. Towards Joseph Martinez, into the path of Lionel Messi. It's Messi against Kobe Franklin to help as well. It's played from Bernadeschi into the path of Osorio, and too far in front of Kerr. Not sure if... The flag might have gone up, but Terry Dunfield with a look of frustration, and rightly so. Hands the captain's armband over to DeAndre Yedlin, and will only make it through 36 minutes of this game. 15 or 20 minutes, such a shame. He's going to go off the field from everyone in the stadium's point of view, I don't think, for TFC's point of view, who start to have a big influence. And the muscle fatigue. Oh, bad ball from Romero. Yeah, TFC have been right in this game. I think they've been up against it in the last 15, 20 minutes. I may have had their chances, but TFC, it is it's still a little bit precautionary. You can make that cup final. Oh, this league, this football in this region will be better for it if he's going to be playing. But they're sitting on the bench there, and you can see there's a little bit of concern in both their faces. They don't look entirely... For injuries and Lionel Messi exiting this one early. Not a sight that Miami. Noah Allen with the cross in, Romero with the punch, not convincing and knocked in by Facundo Farias. And Miami have the lead in stoppage time at the end of the first half. They've lost Messi and Alba due to injury, but the fireworks still going off in Fort Lauderdale. A side that simply has to win in the push for the playoffs. Farias 
Bradley heads away. Joseph Martinez couldn't get there. A Galaxy take on Minnesota. Ball played through for Yedlin. Rosted coming in with a challenge, and the Norwegian defender goes down the way if you missed it. Returning to Starbeck. Romero coming quickly out. Uh, Starbeck in a bit of a relegation fight towards the. Bernadeschi. Now Insigne tried to pass it into that bottom right corner. Career. The first time he's left the game, having started it in the first half since October of 2018. And we're underway at Drive Pink Stadium in Fort Lauderdale. Got Bernadeschi cutting back inside. And Bernadeschi perfectly placed, but denied. Mal Miller, Bernadeschi. A bright start from him in this second half, and that ball played into the front post. DeAndre Kerr unable to do much about it, and it's Bernadeschi's ball in towards DeAndre Kerr. Wasn't too far away, but this is Insigne straight at Calendar. Against Petretto as it comes back here, flicked inside by Farias. This is Ruiz towards the byline. Off Michael Bradley it goes, and out of play from Miami corner on the far side. Busquets around the six-yard box at the front post there as it comes back towards Aviles. Taylor driving it in, and it's 2-0 for Miami. The man who came on to replace Lionel Messi doubles the lead for Tata Martino's side, eight minutes after halftime. And down the seats again. Ronadeski. Is forward from the back. As this one is whipped in, Calendar gets a good punch to it under pressure from Rosted. Ebarra plays it back in. And here come the changes. By right, two goals to nil. As this one is floated in towards Campana, Romero comes to claim if you uh, didn't. And it's sort of having their own competition for playoffs as well. Roll forward into the path of Kravaski! Instant impact off the bench. And while most of the spotlight in Miami this season is on Lionel Messi, they can shine it on the 18 year olds, the homegrown product who continues to. And now it's Taylor. What a finish! Emphatic. An incredible impact in the game. From Taylor, who came on in the first half to replace the injured Lionel Messi, and he finishes with two goals and an assist. And Miami have four as they dismantle Toronto FC without Alba and Messi on the pitch.